Yo, what's up everybody? It's your boy Floss back again with another video and today we're going to take a look at Pen Powers World Pen Scan X. Now this is an intelligent handheld pen scanner and translator. First up, let me show you the website real quick so you can see where to get it from. Go to Amazon.com. I'll throw the link up in the description. Alright, so we got Pen Powers World Pen Scan X. Now, intelligent handheld pen scanner and translator. This will work for iOS, Android, Mac, and Windows. The price for this, $169.95. So you're looking at $170. Bucks. Now, I know what you're saying. That's a little bit on the steep side, but keep in mind that this is a product that you'll buy for your household. Not just for you, for everybody in your house. Depending on where you work at, something like this can make your job 10 times easier. Also, if you're a student, this is really going to come in handy. Let's go through some of the features real quick. Bluetooth wireless connection to mobile devices instantly ready when powered on. Now it recognizes French, Spanish, German, Italian, English, Arabic, basically over 200 languages. Now you can immediately translate and edit in Word, Excel, PowerPoint, iWork, emails, and browsers. You can also do an advanced search on Google, YouTube, and Wikipedia. All right, so 170 for this, let's check it out. Now like I said, a little bit on the pricey side, but this is one of those products that you only got to buy once. Now, if I would have had this a couple of years ago when I used to work in business management, this would this would have made my life a hundred times easier. And I'll show you why. First up, presentation. Okay, beautiful presentation. A buck seventy, you expect that. Basically the same specs from the website. We'll go over all this stuff in a minute. Now, I actually been using this. I just put it back in the box for dramatic effect. <laughs> just so I can see what, it, what it's going to look like when you get it. But I'm pretty much familiar with it already. So inside, you get micro USB charging cable. This is how you're going to charge up the device. And it's one of those flat cables. All right, so I might use this for something else too. This is one of those really nice USB cables. Real nice. Okay. Now, of course, fellas, you know what's coming next. The usual books and shit. But since this works with your Mac and your Windows computer, you're going to have your CD. Install this if you're going to use this on your computer, but if you plan on using this on a tablet, an iPad, a Galaxy tablet, or a phone, iPhone, Galaxy S, S6, whatever phone you got, you won't need this for now. But save that just in case you want to use it for your computer or you want to let somebody else use it, give them the disc with it and let them use it for your computer. I'll use it for the computer. Now this also comes with a warranty card. You get a full one year warranty. Definitely want to save that. Let's see, you got some other products from the company read that later and you're getting started guide also known as the usual books and shit now file that to the side like I said we'll, re we'll read through that another time okay beautiful presentation now this will pop out of here okay so here goes your scanner let's get this out of the plastic okay almost looks like a sharpie like a, like a bigger version of a sharpie Extremely, extremely lightweight. Okay? No batteries in here now. This charges up. So you don't have to worry about putting AA batteries and AAA batteries. If you got a portable battery charger, micro USB cable, any one of your Android phones will work. Charge it right up. Okay, so you got your power button. Got a little ball right here. This is how you're going to scan words. And you got some LEDs. And we'll go through what all that stuff means in a second. So now let me grab my phone and show you how easy it is to pair up. I already paired it up earlier, but it only took a second. All right, so let me show you the app. Now, if you have an Android or, or iPhone, all you have to do is get this app right here. Okay, it's called World Pen Scan. You get that app, pop it open, and this is it. So you got a dictionary, you got a translator, and you got your data input. So basically what the dictionary is, you scan a word, and it'll give you the, the definition of that word. Really simple. Now, for students and all that, that's gonna come in handy. When you're doing your research, not only students, but business people, just anybody, when you're reading for leisure, anytime you got a word that you don't know, you pull out your World Pen Scan X, you scan that word, you don't know more going to your phone and Googling and all that, this'll just make you feel a little bit more bossy too. Pull this out, scan the word, get your definition right there. Now, as far as translating, same thing. If you got some uh, instructions, maybe you bought something. Now, I'll tell you real quick. 
I just ordered um the Galaxy S6, the Gear VR, straight from Japan. Who knows if they're going to come with instructions, you know, in Japanese. So, therefore, instead of having to, you know, transcribe the, the Japanese into my Google Translate, I'll just take this world pen scan, I'll scan the information that I need to know, it'll pop up on this and translate it for me. And same thing now with data input. You click on data input and you just scan words and you could share them, save them to your Excel, email them to people, do whatever you got to do. So let me give you a quick demonstration. This product is pretty hot. Now, as far as books, <laughs> as far as books go, I don't be reading too much these days. <laughs> I'm retired from that game, but I do got some stuff that I do read from time to time like this. <laughs> Big giant Mortal Kombat books. Now, I'll read this in the house, okay? Now, what I also do is I'll print out some of the stuff because if you, now, this is just off the topic real quick, but if you play games like Mortal Kombat and all that, it's a lot of stuff you gotta memorize. And I find it easier for me to memorize, like when you wanna do a fatality, you don't just press one button, you gotta do up, down, back, back, left, right. You know, you gotta do a whole sequence, B, A. You know, you gotta do a whole sequence, and then, you know, the fatality will pop up. So when I'm studying, this that's how I study nowadays, now that I'm retired from all that, you know, work stuff. When, when I'm studying my Mortal Kombat fatalities, I like to write them on a piece of paper. I find it easier for me to remember stuff after writing it down. But now with this, I've been playing with it for a couple of minutes now, and I'm having a lot of fun. Let me show you how it works. Okay, so now I'm going, let's go back out real quick. I'm gonna go to data input. Okay, so now you got your data input screen right here. All you gotta do is grab your pen. We're gonna hit that power button. Okay, matter of fact, let's pair it up first. Now, let me show you how easy to pair up. Just go to hit Bluetooth on. It's going to start scanning, connect it, just like that. Less than five seconds to pair, no need to go to your settings menu, no Bluetooth, no codes and all that. Now, I did have a pop-up for if you have an HTC phone, you might have to put in one, two, three, four. I never tried it with the HTC just yet. I've only been using it on my Nexus and on my iPad. Okay, so now let's, let's go to data input. We'll put the phone right here for a second. Now, let's, uh, let's scan a word real quick or a title and let's see if it uh, works. It's got it upside down, why not? Now, once you get, you see that little ball on the bottom? That's how you're going to roll it along the page. So if you look close to it, you see there's an arrow. So you want to put that arrow a couple of, a little bit right before the words or the phrase that you're going to scan. And you'll see a green light pop on. Now, I don't know if you'll be able to see it with this camera angle. Let me see. I should have, matter of fact, well, let me get up close. Okay, let me just get up close. Let's see if y'all can see that green light. I'm holding it at a funny angle. All right, well, you might not be able to see it, but just take my word for it. <laughs> Once you start scanning, a green light is going to pop on this, let you know that it's recognizing that word. Okay, so let's uh, scan this word real quick. I don't know if y'all can see that. All right, I did it. I did it kind of slow. Let me clear that. Let me clear that up real quick. A little bit, a little bit more difficult from behind the camera. All right, so I just scanned some words. You see, I stopped a little bit early because it's two line words, but it basically came out to what I was writing. Okay, fatalities and brutalities. <laughs> and that's what we got here, fatalities and brutalities. Now, I will say this. It's a little learning curve on this. All right, now, it's not like you just pull it out the box and you go like this and start, you know, scanning real fast. It's going to take a few seconds to learn how to, how to hold it the correct way, what speed you got to go through, to get the full scan. Now let me clear that again. Let's try another word, another phrase. Okay, let's see. Now it popped up exactly what I what I was on the paper right here. Okay, fatalities must be performed from a specific distance away from your opponent. And if you look closely, fatalities must be performed a specific distance away from your opponent. Now you can also read it. Fatalities must be performed from a specific distance away from your opponent. Okay, now you can also copy that to your clipboard. You can also clear it to start something else over. You can save it as a file, or you can hit share. And once you hit share, all your apps that you can share it to will pop up. And it's going to be the same thing on your iOS devices. Alright, now this is kind of hot. So like I said, what I'll probably use it for is I'll do stuff like this. Like you see... 
If y'all watch my Mortal Kombat Online videos, it seems like I just know every fatality by heart. It's a lot of work that goes into that. So I have stuff like this already printed out. Let's see. Um. Okay, so say I've been playing with Erm Slap the other day. This is how you do a fatality. You got a whole block. You hit down, up, back, release block. Okay, now that's simple enough, but try memorizing all of these different fatalities for all, you know, all of the characters. That's what I do on my spare time. I, you know, I do stuff like that. So now what I, I'll, let's, let's just try that one more time. Let's clear this out. So now what I'll do is I'll scan them and I'll email them into my phone. So now when I go to my boy's house to play Mortal Kombat and we getting drunk and we playing for money and all that, I'm not going to roll up. I'm not going to roll up there with this. I'm not going to roll up there with a big book. And I'm not going to even roll up there with this. I'm not going to have papers folded up in my pocket. Now, I know what you're saying. Yeah, you could just text them to yourself and all that. Yeah, I could do that. But it's more fun doing it like this. And like I said, this is a family product now. This is not just something I'm going to use. Now, when my daughter got to do studying and all that, I give it to her and she got to do her book reports and all that. I'll teach her how to use this and it'll make learning a little bit more fun for her. You gave it to your girl, she use it. And, and it, like I said, depending on where you work at, if you're an accountant, a lawyer, business administrator and all of that, this can make your job a whole lot easier. Trust me. All right, so let's try one more before we, uh, before we mess with the, uh, the other features. Okay, now, you see, once you get it, if you get it at the wrong angle, you see that red light will pop up. All right, so the blue will come back on and let you know it's ready again. If it's wrong, if it's not right, that red light's going to pop up. All right, now let's just see what we came here. Okay, hold back, hold block, down, up, back, release block. All right, so like I said, a little bit of learning curve. You'll get the hang of it after playing with for a few minutes. Now what I'll do is I'll just take this and I'll share it to my, G my Gmail or share it to, as myself as a text message. I get a, I'll find out all of the ones that I'm going to use for that night. I'll send them to myself as a message. Then when we gambling and playing for money and all that, I'll just pull out my phone. You know, and you know, it's kind of a code. You don't be on Google, Google and fatalities and all that. Nobody got time for that. I'll just have this. That's just one of my personal uses. But you'll use it for whatever you want to do. And like I said, 170 bucks, a little bit pricey, but you only got to buy this once. You only got to buy this once. And especially if you're giving it to the kids to use while they're in school and all that, that's that, you know, you can't put a price on your own education. You can't put a price on that, on, especially on making education easier. All right. Everybody knows when you got a book, especially if it's not your book and you have to copy stuff out of the book or just look at it and type it into your computer, that gets annoying after a while. Once you get the hang of this, you'll be breezing through stuff, paragraphs. You'll be breezing through paragraphs in minutes. No more, you know, having to stop and go like this. You know, I, I don't know how fast y'all type, but me, I hate typing. I hate typing. After a couple of minutes, I'm always like this. You know, I'm, I get annoyed. So this is just going to help out. Now, before we get out of here, I want to show y'all one more thing. Let's use the translate feature. I printed out something because I don't really have nothing in other languages. So I just printed out something in a different language. And we're just going to uh, translate it real quick. Okay, so we'll, we'll, now if you notice too, it comes up big on the top. So if I scan something that has like a, a picture or, you know, it's written in bold, colorful letters, it's going to come up the way it looks on that page. That's a nice feature right there too. All right, so let's get out of this. Uh, we, don't, we don't need to save that. Let's go to translation. All right, so now I got it set to translate from uh, French to English. Okay, now I got a little phrase that I printed out. In French, all y'all French cats out there, y'all know what it means already. Let's just scan this and see what it means. Okay. Now it popped up just like it's written here. All right, now it came up, stop hate. <laughs> now when I typed it, when I typed it in the computer, I typed in stop hating. But it came up, stop, stop hate. But you get it, you get the idea that it works. Let's, let me put the volume up on this. Now, if you want to learn how to pronounce it in French. And there it goes. Think about when you're traveling, you know, out of the country or traveling places that, you know, English or whatever language you speak is not the not that lang you know, not the main language. Say when I go overseas, when I go to the UK and I'm, I'm, or I'm in Australia or something or somewhere and they speak in another language. I go to the restaurant and I get the menu. How, how, how hard is that going to be when I pull out my phone and I go on the menu and I scan something upside down, of course, I scan something and I just, you know, translate it right there. This is just, you know, straight up boss. 
straight up boss. This is a nice little product to have. Now, I had it on the table. I was using it and playing around with it, maybe about two o'clock in the afternoon. Left it on. Left it on on the table. Came back in the house at around four o'clock. It was still on and the battery level, it looked like it had about 20% left. So I would assume anywhere from three to four hours in battery life. But I know I had it for sure. It wasn't even a full charge right out of the box. I had it for sure on the table on idling for two hours. So now, if you figure if you're studying or doing some kind of work, you're not really going to be doing that kind of heavy duty work for more than two, three hours straight. And if you're you know, doing work in the office, you're going to have access to a battery charger or cable or something. You just plug it in. All right. Now, this is this. This is just a really cool, innovative product. And like I said, when, when, once the kids get the hang of this, that's the end of it. They're not going to be writing anything no more. They're not going to be typing no more. Everything is going to be using this. All right. So this is the future right here. Hit me up in the comments. Let me know what y'all think about this. I know everybody's going to say the price is a little bit steep, but you got to pay to play. All right. You got to pay to play. That's the rules to the game. Hit me up too if y'all wanna uh, if y'all wanna see where I got this from. I got a matter of fact, I got, I think I got this from Amazon too one night. I don't remember, or did I get this from GameStop? But this is cool though. This is some good reading right here. All right, if you want to get the backdrop to all of the characters and show you all the uh, combos, all the special moves and all that, as y'all can see, I take this pretty seriously. It's not just a game for me because, like I said, I be you know I play for money. So I you know this is a little bit more serious for me. But all in all. The World Pen Scan X on a scale of 1 to 10, this is a win. Build quality, and you see it has this rubber grip around it. So it's kind of like when you're holding a pen. You know, certain you know good pens have that rubber right here, so after a while, it doesn't feel like you're just holding a piece of plastic. It almost feels like holding a good pen. And it's so lightweight that it's not going to be, you know, after a while, you got to put it down and, and, and flex. No, it's very, very lightweight. It almost feels like it should have batteries in it. You ever get a remote control and it doesn't have batteries in it and when you pick it up you know it doesn't have batteries because it just feels too light that's how this feels it feels like this it feels like you should have to open it and drop two batteries in it but it's just that light all right so all in all i'm feeling this hit me up in the comments let me know what y'all think i'm giving it a win though all right now only thing only only thing is i would have said if it was me if it was if if i had some stock in world pan scan x <laughs> world pan scan x i would drop the price to this to say maybe Maybe about 120, anywhere from 100 to 120, and these things will be flying off the shelf. I know that that you know that 170 price tag might be a little bit leery. Some people might you know whatever, uh, just a gadget and all that. But um, trust me, once you get it, you're gonna forget about the price. And if you have to use it one time, if you have to use it one time when it's gonna be one of those long nights and you had to be, you know, looking at stuff out of a book and typing into your computer to email to somebody else, if you use it for that one night. It'll save you two hours. It's worth the money. All right, trust me. It's definitely worth the money. Let me know what y'all think. Shout out to everybody that rock with me on Facebook, Foursquare, Twitter, Google+. Plus. Shout out to all the Google gangsters. I see y'all holding down that Facebook page. Shout out to everybody. Hit me up on Voxer. And a special shout out to everybody rocking with me on Instagram. Y'all know that's where I'm at full time. 100% full throttle. And a special shout out to everybody rocking with the Amazon Warrior on Sundays. Y'all already know. Stream gangsters on deck. Get your drinks ready. No meat boys a lot. Oh yeah, one more thing. I almost forgot. Fellas, ladies, say it with me. Or y'all haters, or y'all trolls. Close your eyes and picture me rolling. It's your boy Floss, I'm out. Deuces. <laughs>